Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So for tonight's tea I am going to be making the Pinch of Nom Beef Stroganoff. So I'm just about to pop on my rice and my vegetables. And whilst they boil, um, I'm going to prepare the beef stroganoff. Now I've not done this recipe before, so it's going to be my first time doing it. But I've seen a couple of people have made it on Instagram and they have really enjoyed it. So we'll see how it goes. This recipe on the Pinch of Norm website serves four. So I'm just going to adapt it slightly to serve two. So instead of 220 grams of Philadelphia lightest, I'm going to use 110 grams. So that'll be one healthy extra A or five and a half sins. It's two teaspoons of Worcestershire sauce, one teaspoon of white wine vinegar, one teaspoon of Dijon mustard for half a sin, two teaspoons of brandy, which is optional and would be one and a half sins. And I'm not going to bother using that. You'll need some beef stock, some salt and pepper and some fresh parsley and then obviously your steak, thinly sliced, mushrooms and onion. So if you're like me and you hate chopping stuff up, this Briefton's chopper is absolutely fab. You just put it down like that and then give it a good... It chops it up like that. So that is the mushrooms and onions all chopped up. I've just started frying off the steak with some fry lights and a bit of salt and pepper on top. And once this is pink in the middle, I will transfer it to a bowl until we add it later on. I've now got the steak in a bowl and I've just deglazed the pan with white wine vinegar and Worcestershire sauce, added some fry light and I'm just frying off the mushrooms and the onions. So it's now time to add in the Dijon mustard and you'd also add your brandy now if you were adding it. So I'm just using one teaspoon of the Dijon mustard and then I'll cook it for a further piece. Now it's time to add the stock. I've had 250ml and I'll let it simmer, I'm going to add the Philadelphia and then I'll put the steak back in. So this is the mixture all together, I'm going to leave it for probably a couple of minutes and then I'll add the beef in and cook it for a further 5 minutes and then it will be ready to plate up. So here is the finished product. This is the beef stroganoff with rice and vegetables.